Hi, I'm Dr. Bill Wallace. I'm a surgeon and a missionary. I help people at the hospital and I also tell them about Jesus. Some people here in China are very poor and do not have enough to eat. Some people that I meet are very sick and do not have a way to get to a doctor. I try my best to help everyone that I can. People in the government don't like me talking about Jesus. They do not believe in him. Even though it's scary sometimes, I will stay in China to serve Jesus and the people. It's better to trust in God and obey him. In our Bible story this week, we learned how God loves all people and how he showed mercy to the Ninevites. He wants us to love people and show mercy to others as well. What are some ways that missionary Bill Wallace showed love and mercy to his neighbors? Bill Wallace served God in China many years ago. Missionaries today serve all over the world so that others will know about God and choose to love Him. Today I brought my globe with me and I put a sticker over the United States, specifically over Tennessee, because that's where Dr. Bill Wallace grew up, just like you and I. When he got older, God called him to move to China, which is all the way across the world to here. Bill Wallace obeyed God and went to China in the year 1935. Sometimes it was scary to be there because China was at war. Bill was even arrested and put in jail in 1950 because some people didn't like him telling others about Jesus. Telling people about Jesus can be scary sometimes, but we can still obey with God's help because Jesus is King and is worthy of it all. Bill Wallace showed mercy by helping people who are sick and by sharing meals with people who may not have food. There's a lot of ways we can show mercy to our family, our friends, and our neighbors. But here's a few ideas for you to try. If someone does something mean to you, don't treat them badly in return. If someone does something mean to you, do something nice to them instead. Offer forgiveness to someone who has wronged you, even before they ask for it. And you can even trade your large ice cream cone for a sibling smaller one. Let's wrap up today by reading from Micah chapter 6, verse 8. It says, the Lord has told you what is good. He has told you what he wants from you. Do what is right to other people. Love being kind to others and live humbly, trusting your God.